Hello, my name is Aaron Fisher, and I am the Youth Livestock and Equine Specialist in the Department of Animal Science at the University of Tennessee. I am presenting a video study series focused on swine-related topics for the Skillathon. This particular episode will focus on swine breeds. We will talk about several popular breeds in the United States and how they are classified, where they are from, and the important qualities that each bring to the swine industry. Similar to other species, swine breeds are primarily distinguished by their body color. Learning the colors of the various breeds along with the size of their ears will allow you to be able to determine the breed of a given hog. Swine breeds are typically classified as maternal or terminal breeds. Maternal breeds are those that are known for good mothering ability, milk production, and fertility traits. These breeds are the breeds whose body is solid white. Terminal breeds are those that are known for high growth and performance, leanness, muscle, and or good pork quality. These breeds are the breeds that typically have some color other than white on their body. The first breed is Berkshire. Berkshire is a terminal breed from England and is black with white points and erect ears. The Berkshire breed is known for producing carcasses with high marbling and high overall pork quality. Chester White is a maternal breed from Pennsylvania. It is solid white with small drooping ears. Chester White is known for high conception rates. Duroc is a solid red terminal breed with small drooping ears. It originated in the eastern United States. Duroc is known for being exceptionally lean and fast growing. Hampshire may be the most recognizable breed as it is black with a white belt that goes across the shoulders all the way to its feet and has erect ears. It is from England and Scotland and is known for being lean and heavily muscled. Hereford is a terminal breed that originated in Missouri. It resembles the Hereford breed of cattle with its red body and white face and legs. It also has drooping ears. Landrace is a maternal breed whose origin traces back to Denmark. It is solid white with large floppy ears. It is known for being very prolific with large litter sizes. The Poland China breed is a terminal breed that originated in Ohio from several different breeds. It is black with white points and has drooping ears. Piatrin is a terminal breed from Belgium. It has black spots on the body with erect ears. It is known as the leanest and heaviest muscled of the terminal breeds, but is of much less prominence because of pork quality problems associated with stress. These stress problems lead to PSE pork, or pale, soft, and exudative. Spotted is a terminal breed that originated in Ohio and traces back to the Poland China breed. It is black with tan spots over the body and has drooping ears. The Tamworth breed is a terminal breed from England with erect ears and is solid red in color. Yorkshire is a maternal breed from England. It is solid white with erect ears and is known for good mothering and milking ability. It is commonly referred to as the mother breed. That wraps up our discussion of swine breeds. Please recognize that there are many more breeds that we did not discuss today. For more information and background on all swine breeds, the Oklahoma State University Animal Science Department maintains the most comprehensive breed site for swine as well as other species. 
You can also check out the individual breed association websites. Yorkshire, Landrace, Duroc, and Hampshire can be found at the National Swine Registry, while Hereford, Chester White, Poland China, and Spotted can be found at the Certified Pedigreed Swine website. I wish you the best of luck as you progress through your swine project. Please let me know if I can ever be of assistance. Thank you and have a great day.